Peace is Spirit with Allen Family Network here, and we're getting into how to build your credit fast. So how to build your credit fast. And I'm reading this directly from our book and our course, and you can grab that. You, you know, you can enroll in our Wealth University and go through this and build your credit with us. But I'm going to tell you how to build your credit fast. And this is all you have to do. So the first thing, step one, open a secured credit card. So you can do this with your bank or with a bank, credit union, etc. So example, you deposit $500 to get a $500 credit limit on your card. And so once again, that's step one, open a secure credit card. So basically you're giving them $500 in cash in exchange for a credit card with that $500 on it. And they're doing you that way because they don't trust you because, you don't, you, you know, once again, you're building your credit up. So but credit cards, once again, they report to your credit report. And from there, it's going to report that you're making those payments and that starts to build your credit. So hopefully I explained that simply. The second thing, after you open a secure credit card, make sure on that credit card. And I just hit on that second thing. Step two, make sure that you're paying on time. So payment history is one of the biggest influences to your credit score. Just do the automatic payments route for everything that's reported in your credit. Remember, we told you so. So with the payments, especially in the beginning while you're building your credit, just do the automatic payments, pay it in full, you know, and from there, like, you know, just let those payments build up because what's happening is your credit is going to build, it's going to increase naturally because it's showing that you're making these payments and you're making these payments on time. So, for example, you know, if I'm looking to loan you money in the future, I'm going to look at your credit report and I'm going to see, okay, they've been making payments on time. You know, they've been paying on time. You know, from there, that makes me more likely to loan you money. It shows that you're good with money and can pay me back. Third thing, don't use your credit much while building your credit. So if you need to build your credit to get something in the near future, definitely do this. So example, if you have $500 in credit um, to use, only use $150 or around that 20% or less mark. So for example, if you got a credit card with that $500, we're using this as an example, $500 credit card, just try to use, and that's if you have to, try to use around $150 of it if you have to. Don't go over that. and Or you want to stay around that 20% or less area within that. So long story short, just with your limits, don't use much of it. And, the you know, the little bit that you do use, make sure that you're showing that you're paying it on time and you're paying it off. And you don't want to use a lot because simply explain. They're like, oh, OK. Like they see it as this. They see it like, oh, if you have to use all of that money, what's going on with your finances, like what's happening, you know. So long story short. Don't use much. Don't use much on your credit card. So stay around that 20 percent or less utilization. Hopefully I explained that simply because I don't want to make this nerdy. <laughs> and then the fourth thing is um, you have to get those credit types going. So here's the credit types that you need in addition to that credit card. So you need, of course, credit cards and you need what's called an installment loan. So you need something to show the three nosy, you knows, we call them the nosy ones, but the credit bureaus, you basically to show them that you're capable of paying and have a track record of paying. So if you do not want to commit to an actual loan, so you can go and get a loan or get a small loan or whatever it is and just pay it off because it's showing once again, oh, they can pay credit cards and they can pay a loan off. So it's showing a bigger amount that you're able to pay now. So you know, but if you don't want to commit to an actual loan, there are apps that you can use. We're in 2024 when you're watching this. So it's all kind of apps out there. So you can actually go to the app store and there's an app called Kickoff, Credit Strong. And those are great little apps that you can use and it reports to your credit as a loan. And of course, there are more apps as well, but you can check them out for yourself. So I'll kind of go over that again. The first thing, open a secure credit card. Second, make sure you paying that ish on time. Third, don't use much of your credit. So when you get that credit card, don't use much of it. Number four, 
uh, now you need a loan. You need an installment loan. So some people, they go and, you know, you know, they go and get all kind of loans. You can get a loan from your bank. You can get a car loan, whatever it is, some type of loan. But just make sure that you're making those payments on time with that loan, just like you're doing with the credit card. And um, the last thing, um, well, before I get into the last thing. So, yeah, so with that loan. Once again, make sure you're making those payments on time on that loan. And all of this is very simple. A lot of people complicate this. But once again, you're getting this just to show them documented on your credit that, hey, I can pay stuff off. That's all you're doing. Hey, I can pay stuff off. And here's my record. So you're getting that just to do. You're getting that just to prove to them so you can get that big money from them, if that makes sense. And you do this for a few months. You do this for, you know, you do this for three, six months. And from there, you in the game. But the last thing, so number one, open a secure credit card. Number two, pay on time. Number three, don't use your credit much. Number four, you can get a loan. And then the last one, you can find a family member with good credit. Let me tell you about it. So ask your good credit having family member for a lifeline. <laughs> so basically ask them if you can add, if they can add you as what's called an authorized user on their credit cards. So this allows you to be seen in a positive light because you are connected to someone with good credit. Tell them don't trip, it won't affect them in any way either. So long story short, you can you can be added, find a family member or somebody that's close that you close with that has good credit and from there you just become what's called an authorized user on their credit. It's simple. They can go to their app, put you in there. It's really simple. It takes five minutes to do. And from there, that's going to instantly build your credit. So when they're making their payments, it's going to reflect on yours. And it's like y'all are connected at the hip. So from there, when they do great stuff, it's going to look great for you. When you do great stuff, it's going to look great for them. So, And those are the ways. That's how you build your credit. It's really simple. So first thing, I'll go over it once again. Number one. Open a secure credit card. You can do that with a bank, credit union, or your bank, we prefer. Two, pay the stuff on time. Pay it off on time. Simple, right? And you can do that by setting up automatic payments so you ain't even got to worry about it. And just try to pay it all off on time if you can. The third thing, don't use much of your credit. So, for example, if you have a $500 credit card, only use around $150 of it a month. Or you want to be at that 20% or less. So simple. The next thing, you can get an installment loan. And from there, make sure that you're paying that off. The same as you're doing your credit card, paying it all off. And, you know, paying it in full, paying it off. And that's going to look good to people later on. We're doing this so we can get that big money later on. And then the last thing, you could be added as an authorized user on a family member or a friend, whoever, somebody that you're connected to that has great credit. And it's going to look good for you. Make your credit score go up. You know, it's like two people building on one credit, you know. But And that's how you build your credit fast. And that's what we do. It's really simple. We ain't going to overcomplicate it. But I'm Spirit with Allen Family Network. Peace.